for another episode of Fridays with the Baby Girls. I'm Alyssa. And I'm Jessica. And today we're going to be talking about wedding invitations. Wedding invites are your first indicator of what your wedding is actually going to be like, what it's going to look like, kind of like the theme, um, what you want out of your wedding. Not only do your invitations show your theme or style of wedding, but it also gives that important information to all of your guests that are going to be coming. You're going to have the important information like your names, the wedding date, the location, and all of that that are kind of obvious on an invitation, but you can also add some fun and creative things. Yes, you can also include fun interactive questions such as asking your guests um, for a song request or asking them which meal entree they would like if you're offering two or three. Those are things you can include. Also, put your hashtag name on there. Every wedding nowadays has a hashtag. It just makes everything interactive with your guests and your family members. Yeah, so if people hashtag all the pictures that they're posting, you can also look through it and they can see what everyone else has posted throughout the night and it kind of makes it fun and interactive in that way so you can see their perspective on the wedding as well as what your photographer takes. Another thing to think about and remember is postage. So if you're sending out your invites and you have your RSVP included in there, make sure that you not only have the envelope that they can send it back in, also the postage so they don't have to worry about paying for it. Or you could just have an RSVP app online, either through your website or an email response. And don't forget about your registry, whether you just put your uh, website or your wedding website on there, or if you list um, that you're registered at so-and-so, just remember to put it on the invite so that they know where to go um, if you're wanting that to be a part of your invitation. So remember the key things that you're wanting on there, obviously the basics of the names, wedding day, location, all of that. And remember to get creative with it, so adding the music requests or even a map to show the location or if you have a different reception remember to put that and then of course like we talked about your registration stuff so just remember to get creative with it whether it be a theme or your colors and have fun with it thanks for joining us for another friday with the bb girls stay classy brides to be